the pandemic continues to take an economic toll on millions of people, including homeowners and landlords who say they have nowhere to turn to when their tenants can't pay their rent. California's rent moratorium is expected to end January 31st, but the governor says he is hoping to extend it. News 8's LaMonica Peters talks to a local landlord who says extending the moratorium may ruin him financially and put his family's stability in jeopardy. Sean Ibrahim says he and his wife saved for five years to buy their rental property. Now they're in jeopardy of losing it because their current tenants haven't paid rent since the pandemic began. There's a struggle happening in neighborhoods all across the country. Tenants who are out of work can't pay rent, but landlords still have a mortgage to pay. Both are caught in a tight spot. For nine months, they were just saying that they were out of work and they do not have the means to pay the rent. So I understand on their end. But how about us as a homeowners? Sean Ibrahim of San Diego says he has a mortgage for his rental house and his primary home. He says he tried applying for relief through a federal program but was denied. They said that your credit score has been destroyed and I was not even uh, eligible to get any sort of funds. So that was a direct result of me being behind my mortgage. Last month, the Census Household Pulse Survey reported that over 14 million adult Americans say they are behind on the rent. The Southern California Rental Housing Association is an advocacy group for landlords and says there's really only one option for troubled landlords right now. We pushed really hard for rental assistance because it makes both parties whole. You know, residents can apply, they can, like I said, they can get back rent paid, future rents paid, and then the property owner gets their rental income at the same time. It's a win-win. Kirkland also emphasized that landlords cannot force tenants to apply for rental assistance. She said landlords should continue to abide by the rental moratorium and they can create a payment plan once the renters get back to work. LaMonica Peters, News 8.